Geographers of Solitude will be the last production created by Paolo for Svin Molta. What's very special about this piece is that we are collaborating with the Ballet de Jerry, which is great because we get to meet new people and have new energies in the studio. For us, it's really a moment to take inspiration from the other dancers and just uh, share what we have in our pocket and uh, for me, really admire what they have to bring into this process. It's been really amazing the two companies coming together because we're both very different in terms of identity and types of dancers as well. And like, there's a, such a range of different talents in the room, which is really amazing to feed off of. There's always people to take from and learn from and enjoy watching. It's a very good um, experience and experiment, I'd say, both. I particularly enjoy the fact that we're not really two companies anymore and it's not 16 dancers, but it seems like what Paolo is trying to create is one body moving constantly and so it's just this constant shifting and changing and moving but it seems more like one body than two companies and 16 separate dancers. I feel like it just brings oxygen to the group and combining the two has been so refreshing and beautiful to collaborate with. I really enjoy creating material. It's a bit of a mind game a lot of the time. Like we create so much material and then suddenly he puts it all together like a puzzle, but not in the way that you would expect. So a lot of the time it's really using your brain just as much as your body. The people on the edge ideally walk this way, the people on the edge walk this way. So we have this symmetry at the moment. Well, the creation process is always really intense, really stimulating, asking a lot of adaptability on our end as dancers, as he really likes to keep playing with the structure until the really last moment, the really last days, even on stage. The work is built around a big variety of, of tasks, scores, and the material Paolo is also directly creating on us. I'm always looking to the diversity of ways Paolo brings up to make some material emerge. It can come from really technical aspects, uh, almost a scientific point of view, really using the mechanics of the movement itself. And it can go into something really abstract, almost really poetic, and how the poetic help us to enter in a dance. It's been really uh, fun to come in every day and see the piece develop and emerge. And Paolo creates in a way which is like, there's a really set structure, but you don't know how it's going to evolve or you don't know what's going to be used where, which is really interesting. Cause so at any point you could be told to go into this piece of material, that material, and uh, it keeps you on your toes definitely, but it's really fun to see the piece come together that way. Yeah, it's just, it's been really good and I can't wait to get it on stage and to see it at the theatre here in Malta, Teatro Manuel, and to get it over to Jersey at the Art Centre.